Yo, never you mind. It's time for cud. And I got uh, a few treats for y'all. Uh, <laughs> this is going to be one of three different series going up pretty much simultaneously. So as much cud as you can, uh, as you can handle. But um, uh, what we're playing with right here is a modless um, beta. And um, thankfully, Brian has showed me uh, how to not lose your save when there's a new update so you can basically keep playing. So hopefully um, one of the number one reasons I uh, will stop playing CUD is that I lose a save. It doesn't happen anymore. Um, and this is this is the new beta and when i say new beta i mean new as as of t like today um the trailer for 1.0 just came out the announcement for uh publishment from kitfox just happened today and there's a lot of excitement and heck i am i'm ready for some cud it's been a while it's it's been too long you know and um you know I, I, I need to take breaks so that I can come back to, to Caves of Cud with renewed energy um, like like today. Like, I, I want to have that kind of energy um, for playing Cud. I don't ever want to take Cud for granted because, you know, this this game, it's, it's my favorite game. And I would hate to take my favorite game for granted. So, I'm excited to play it today. And um, I'm going to be doing all the same stuff so what kind of build are we doing i usually roll through character creation in the very beginning of caves of code but i decided to do things a little bit differently and i was just kind of poking out into the ether trying to figure out what i wanted to be and i thought because of you know so much um i don't know i, I was just kind of feeling a unstable character so we are a mutant and we are unstable and i don't think i've ever done this kind of build on in a in a series before it's something i would like to do more of because i think that this is one of the most replayable builds um we're going to be basically taking four different mutations and building around those um i picked the warden uh cast is it cast or background i can't remember which i think it's cast if you're a mutant and then it's background or something if you're a uh true kin but anyway we are in fact a warden and so we have short blades. I don't necessarily think I will commit to that, but hey, you know, we're fine. Do we have a gun? No, we don't, but I seem to have marked targets. So I have to assume that we do in fact have bows and rifles. Yes, we do. I've been kind of refamiliarizing myself um, because I've been doing the series with Galen, which hopefully is also going up today. Um, we're going to go ahead. Actually, let's just go ahead and... Uh, uh, all right let's go ahead and take care of that real quick um and uh we're gonna go to rest wells we are playing role play um i'm not gonna apologize for that anymore i think that it's just my preferred way of playing this game um i may one day come back to classic maybe you know maybe when i'm like so oh, yo there it was yo we saw it for the first time ever yo that's some caves of cud history right there boy yo we saw a stone <laughs> would you did you catch it yo blink and you miss it and it was gone there is a throne a, a throne stone a stone throne at me where is our torch i want to catch this on camera oh oh that was that was fantastic. Let's uh, right hand. Um, let's put a torch in that. We do not have. Where is it? Where is, there they are. <laughs> oh, that is so good. They have little little sound effects too. That fills me with a joy that I I cannot describe. I am so happy <laughs> you know, they do be throwing them stones oh god i'm gonna die well that 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 was very much um fleeting should i be i'm in i think i'm in this defensive stance right now maybe i should be in aggressive stance let's go into aggressive stance 
might die. I might die. Uh, how come I can't? Okay, hold on. There's a, a couple of things got shuffled around. Do we have a, uh, let's do rest until fully healed. Let's try rest. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Where are you? Rest until healed. I don't know why that got reset like that. I'm I'm still having some problems with the keybinds. But anyway, we're good now. Okay. So we got ooh, that's a that's a big lad. I don't necessarily want to fight that lad right now. Let's see, uh well actually Okay, he, he already killed the baboon. Is how wounded is he? He's fine. He's not very wounded. He he do be throwing rocks at me though. The, the rocks are so good. I'm just going to wait for a little bit here. Um, no, not wish. Uh, how come shift W isn't wor working? Okay, I gotta, I gotta reset some of my things here. Um, wait. Wait a number of turns. Shift W. Cool. I mean... Let's see, let's try, um... Let's try wait menu and see what that looks like. I'm just curious. Wait until healed. I mean, this kind of works. We'll wait like 20 turns. Okay, they're not coming down. That's the main thing I was kind of concerned about. Yeah, I mean, like maybe when I get to... Oh, okay. So th that's the new animation that shows... There's like... I'm, I'm interrupting myself like every second now. Um, we... Like we... Um, we we've got new animations for basically like, hey, there's a, an enemy on the screen. Which is really nice. That thing just took out a ton of my health in one blow. We really need a, a ranged weapon. We really need a ranged weapon. So we're just gonna, you know, flee for a moment. Maybe this dog will help me for a second. What happened to the blob? What happened to the amoeba? There he is. Um, we'll try a slam. Uh, giant amoeba takes five damage from your shield slam. I died. Well, there it is. <laughs> um, I do have, I am, this is a fairly squishy build. Maybe we'll try red rock first. I took, oh, I only took a 18 toughness and I don't have a lot of agility. In fact, I have almost none. I guess a ranged weapon would actually not help us very much. But, um, I wanted to have, I, I'm kind of tired of doing builds where my intelligence is like shortchanged in the beginning because that means I, it takes me a very, very long time before I get the really good, uh, tinkering stuff. We can, we can kill some cud lads. Um, all right, we'll, we'll go downstairs. So red, red rock. I rarely come to red rock first, but I mean, you know. Desperate times? Are we in desperate? Oh my god, that's a centipede. That thing's gonna tear us apart. It's just average, but at the same, at the same time, um, it's probably gonna tear us apart. We'll do aggressive stance, and um, we'll do a shield slam. There's another centipede. That is really bad. Okay, we'll eat some witchwood bark. Centipede's got sound effects now. Maybe I should um, switch to defensive stance. Okay, we leveled up. I need to back up. We're probably going to die here. Okay, I thought I tried going up, but it didn't seem to work. Please don't get... Oh, God. All right, fine. Did we kill them? We did. Fantastic. Um, we definitely want to kill like everything on this screen because uh, I really that uh, that animation is pretty flashy. I am I hope that 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 th it doesn't end up being a problem for some people, but um, I really do appreciate that there's any animation because it you know like very cleanly communicates right away what's going on quickly save the game i didn't mean to do that sure i'll quick save the game but i um meant to hit i guess i hit f5 out of uh force of habit 
or we're, we're, we're gonna die here injured i need to get into a good um position here okay we got some xp so we we are good we're out of witchwood bark is a little bit of a problem okay on the next floor if i see anything spooky i'm, I'm leaving we could potentially level up here we did level up um okay so we did get an attribute point i think i should maybe put an attribute point into agility i don't know we're in an like putting an agility uh, attribute point into anything isn't really going to help because um everything's on an even keel right now so i won't get anything for for love like advancing them we have a scavenger I don't think we have harvestry, so we can't get the... Oof, that's a big noise outside. I feel like, um... I feel like Dreadroot has been given kind of a, a tile upgrade. It looks a little bit different. I know those are harvestable Dreadroots. But still, they look a little bit different. Oh god, we've got another amoeba. We're still in an aggressive stance. What I might do is I'm gonna... Oh, yeah, we've got a new menu for looking at our skills. Plus one and plus one half penetration. Or is that plus one, two penetration? Um, negative two, negative three to hit while wielding a long blade in your primary hand. So we get less chance of hitting, but we get better pen. Plus two to three DV while wielding a long blade in your primary hand. Okay, so that's not very helpful, especially when our... Um, Agility is so bad, so probably aggressive stance is still good. Uh, definitely want to get into a good position here, so I'm not waiting through slime. They they seem to give up. Okay, and we'll shield slam them and poke. Ouch! We don't have any more. Um, which would bark? So I'm kind of flying by the seat of my pants here. I might end up sprinting away. Okay, well, that's really bad luck. We we got centipeded. We're probably dead here. Yeah, we died. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's gonna... It's. Uh, I guess this is what I get for making a low agility build. I'm gonna try Red Rock again because we at least made a bit more um, progress there. We leveled up a couple of times. We're just gonna, you know, we're gonna make our way over there. Yeah, I mean, I, I died a couple times. We can kill a couple glowfish. At the very least, that would, you know, buy us a little bit of free XP. You know, it's, it's a rough run right away when we're, like, killing glowfish to level up. I mean, that takes me right back. That's, like, our my first playthrough of Caves of Cut was basically reduced to um, killing glowfish. For XP but it's you know it's been a while so I'm gonna forgive myself I'm gonna allow myself to make these uh, early game mistakes okay we're level two um, we'll make our way down I think we still get 25 XP for killing kudzu we get 20 XP Level two, uh, immediately kudzu are, are less viable for XP. Sometimes that's not the case. Iron buckler is rusted. Oh god. So I'm already uh, kind of hosed for my AV. It really sucks because like everything I'm doing right now, um, I I'm taking like every single attack. So there's our centipede. We'll still shield slam them. You must have a shield equipped. Okay, so we don't get we don't have shield slam anymore. Okay, we'll just fight him the old-fashioned way then. There's another one around here. There it is. Okay, we leveled up. Good, good, good. Level three. We're making uh, we're we're making some progress here. If I could get to level four, I might just head back to Jopa and call it a day. 
Also, one thing I could do is fully explore this. Oh God, why? That was, that was a really bad way to encounter that amoeba. Okay, we did kill them. They're only 25 XP. There's a, there's our staircase leading down. So let's take it. I would really hate for us to lose our only weapon. Oh my god. I'm I'm having some really bad luck right now. We did actually kill them. I was really worried that I was I was going to die there. Okay, we're no longer auto exploring. We're we're at the point now where that's just too dangerous. I would really like to get to level four and then try and save my progress. Get out of here, scavenger. Did we get anything cool? Oh, there's a wooden buckler. At the very least, that will uh, get a slam back. Iron longsword. Is that what we're using right now? Yeah, okay. No longer auto exploring. Oh, well, that was silly. I I'm going too fast. Okay. Just do what we can. 13, 12, 8. Um, okay, they're dead. We are very. Oh, okay. C Cannibal, we should be able to take out. We're good there. Now we're we're pretty close to level four. A couple of kudzu would actually do me nicely. We're very close now. We've got a our centipede there. We're in a we're in a standstill here. Oh my god. Okay, level four. Perfect. Let's get out of here. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, get out of Red Rock and we're... You're lost. I'm apparently lost. My goodness. I think it's hilarious that we encountered baboons at Rust Wells and not at Red Rock. Generally speaking, Red Rock is known for its uh, rock-toting baboons. I really expected to, to find them there. But yeah, the game's got animations now. Like, a lot of animations. And that's, like, a huge deal. Um, I'm very excited about this. I know that Brian's been putting a lot of work in uh, the last couple of weeks, adding all of these extra animations in. And so the game is going to feel a lot more like, uh, not to be redundant, but or a broken record, but uh, animated. Okay, so um, why don't we... We didn't complete any quests. We don't have anything we can give up. Um, we can sell the iron buckler, I suppose, or get rid of that. And um, maybe there, there's another uh, iron buckler here? No, probably not. Oh, there's a glow sphere. I would love to have that. We don't have enough to buy that, though. We could sell the canticles. We're actually not good for cash right now. Okay, well, so we can't really do anything. Let's go back to the Rust Wells. Now that we're level 4, I think we'll have a slightly better chance. I love that animation so much. It's so good. Okay, let's wait like uh, 20 turns. Ah. Wow, they hit hard. Jeez Louise, I'm, I'm suffering right now. What do we get? 125 XP for that. We're bleeding. We actually blocked that. It was pretty good. Cool. 
We got 125 XP for that as well. So I just need to... We're just going to go downstairs. I can't remember what killed me before. I think it was an amoeba. I think the amoeba got very lucky. You're famished. Okay, let's go ahead and... Um, I forgot that I don't have... Make a camp set to anything. So we're going to go ahead and... Do that. But I guess I didn't press the right button. What is it now to set it? Enter is activate selected ability. That was no... That wasn't true. Insert is bind key where's insert is it this okay that's different so it's ins key so the amoebas for sure around here there it is it's probably gonna hurt us just as much as it did before uh, it almost took us out there We're still getting 20 XP for the kudzu, so it is worth killing them. I am a little bit worried that we are going to um, rust our weapon by doing so. What did we just rust? Something just got rusted. Well, there is a sound effect sounding like rust. Um, looking for a staircase. Looking for a staircase. Hopefully we find it very soon. What was rusted to dust? Your wire strand was rusted to dust. Okay. I can live with that. I mean, it kind of sucks, but... They are rusting a lot of our wire right now, but we just got ourselves as the 50, uh, 50 inch. Oh, we got a crab. That might hurt. They are injured. I don't think we're gonna... I don't think we have the chops to do this. I don't know what I did wrong with this build, but it's not good right now. It is not working for me. And, uh, I mean, like, you know things are bad when you're, like, losing the crabs. Are we lost? Yeah, we're lost. And we have a chameleon. They did die to an Echomax, though. So, I mean, we're just going to roam around in the wilds as we do. You know, Caves of Cud stuff. Just just Caves of Cud stuff. It's fine. Recognize the area. Oh, we're back in Rustwells. How did we end up back in Rustwells? Oh, that's right. Um, when you get lost now, you don't, you're not guaranteed to go to the center tile anymore of the parasang. So you could get lost behind where you were going, which is kind of funny. I, it's kind of hilarious to me that that can happen. We really need some more Witchwood Bark. So we're going to talk to Elder Irodad and hopefully they have a little bit of it. They have one. We'll take it. We could really use some. We haven't gotten our um, first mutation yet, which is kind of wild. We've leveled up three times, and we have yet to get ourselves a mutation. Well, let's just hope that, um, you know, fifth time's the charm. Fourth time's the charm. Very, We're very sloshy right now. We're sloshing all over the place. We do be sloshing. Ooh, what's what was that? That looked like something good. Never mind, we're just gonna die instead. Oh, there's another centipede. Shoot. Okay, let's um take some witchwood bark while they make their way over here. Of course, then I walked up to them like a dang fool. So what is that? That is a bronze two-handed sword. I don't think that this is good. Please don't die. Oh my god. Please kill him. He's not, I haven't even done any damage. Oh my god. I'm I'm like eating it. From uh, centipedes. We were down to one health and I managed to escape with my life. 
don't 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 speak too soon you know we are slipping oh my god please go up the stairs i keep slipping on slime and finding myself in a different tile okay all right you're lost all right it cuds in a mood I, I i often say this but sometimes cud finds itself in a mood and um you, you know the player is the one that suffers so i'm just gonna kill some glowfish and try my very best to stay alive stay hydrated stay in my lane 25 xp if we can kill like a couple more glowfish then we'll actually level up not a great idea to fight glowfish while you're swimming your you ent your genome enters an excited state. Would you like to spend four mutation points to buy a mutation before right? I guess so because we still didn't get an activated mutation. So we have domination, multiple arms. Gonna have to go with multiple arms. You know I love me some multiple arms, and I mean this is a long sword build. I don't think that that actually benefits from multiple arms it was between this and axe build i haven't really done much with with long swords i would like to try something um but uh you know i could just pivot the whole thing to axes because i like axes a lot or cudgels you know y'all know i love me my my cudgels okay we're gonna go to jopa um I'm not sure. I guess we're here just to save more than anything. We're level five. Um, we have 60 drams. We could go to the six day stilt. Kind of just want to check out the historic site. Just see what's going on. Got 250 XP. Um, okay. I'm actually going to leave it here. Um, yeah, I just want to like get the series started uh so i know that uh, this is a short episode for what i've generally been doing but you know i i want to plant a, a stake i want to i want to plant a stake and you know like really just kind of get this series started get my feet wet back in uh in caves of cud and um you know I, I really appreciate everyone's patience while i do other things i you know hope that you don't mind that i have to take breaks and, you know, if you don't want to watch my other stuff, there's always the option of not doing that, right? But um, I'm glad to be back, and um, I'm looking forward to more of this. So I'll see you all uh, next time. If you did enjoy this, definitely do me a solid. Hit that like button. Consider subscribing, all that good stuff. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.